On August 3rd, 1936, James Cleveland Jesse Owens won the 100 meter dash at the Berlin Olympics and blazed into the record books. Owens went on to everlasting fame by winning four gold medals in those summer games, proving to Hitler and Nazi Germany that Aryans were not the master race. But what about the guy that came in second in that historic race? That man was Ralph Metcalf. Born in Atlanta in 1910 and raised in Chicago, Metcalf, once co-holder of the world record for the 100-meter dash, was no slacker himself, winning silver medals in the 100-meter dash in two Olympics. In 1934 and 1935, before Jesse Owens's rise to the top, Metcalf was considered the fastest man on the planet. Metcalf also picked up a gold medal in the 4x100-meter relay in the 1936 Berlin Olympics and had once held the 200-meter dash record as well. Not just a fantastic track athlete, Metcalf made good use of a track scholarship to Marquette, earning his bachelor's degree in 1936. A true scholar-athlete, he went on to UCLA and earned a master's degree in 1939, quite an accomplishment for a black man in pre-World War II America. As a teacher of political science at Xavier University in New Orleans, Metcalf went on to mold young people, and during World War II, he served as a transportation officer, earning a Legion of Merit medal along the way. After the war, Metcalf returned to Chicago and got a job as head of the Illinois State Athletic Commission. Metcalf then went into politics, winning four elections as an alderman in Chicago, and in 1970, he became a Democratic congressman for Illinois' 1st District. Known to stick up for his constituents, Metcalf had disagreements with Mayor Richard Daley over the use of police force, and in Congress, he co-founded the Congressional Black Caucus. After serving four terms in Congress, Metcalf died of a heart attack at his home in 1978. Before his death, Metcalf had been inducted into the National Track and Field Hall of Fame in 1975, and he had also served on the President's Commission on Olympic Sports. Honor student, Olympian, and world record sprinter, Metcalf excelled at many things. As a decorated Army officer, successful politician, husband, and father, the guy that finished second to Jesse Owens in the 1936 Olympics finished second to no one in life. His exemplary life and careers are a stark contrast to the list of 10 sports scandals we also published on August 3rd, and another list we published on October 5th, 1 plus 9 more sports scandals, and are a reminder that some things are right with the world after all. As a question for my students and subscribers, who is your favorite Olympic athlete? Please let us know in the comment section below this video. If you like this video and would like to receive notification of new videos, please feel welcome to subscribe to History and Headlines and become one of our patrons. Your viewership is much appreciated.